Hey YouTubers, this is KingLink86. Now, the National Museum of Play has revealed 15 finalists for its inaugural World Video Game Hall of Fame. And what's great about this, one of these choices will be in the Hall of Fame for years to come. Now there are 15 choices and I want you guys to, to decide which one you believe should be in the Hall of Fame. Now, the first one is Angry Birds. Now you guys know that a very addicting app where you fling birds and kill pigs, which is very good. Now, a computer game, Doom. That was my first mature video game that I've ever played as a kid. I had to ask my parents in order to play it because there was blood, you know, shooting soldiers, shooting demons. Very bloody game. Now, FIFA. Now, it's a good, it's a good game about sports on, on uh, soccer, which was very good. I liked it, but I'm not very much of a sports person. But now, there's one, the, the fourth choice that I believe would be in there is The Legend of Zelda. Has multiple games, multiple levels, best dungeons, best villains, and I saw the greatest character, Link, that holds the sword. The Master Sword, of course. Now, the fifth choice is Minecraft. Now, I've never played that game before, but it looks really interesting, and I'm sure that a lot of gamers have tried it, but not have I, but... I will give it a shot, but I don't know about that choice. Now, a classic computer game, Oregon Trail. Now, I used to play Oregon Trail when I was in elementary school. And now that is a very good choice. You know, rowing off, the, oh, rowing off. You have to shoot livestock. You have to treat sick people. And it's very a, a great game. Now, next one. The Yellow Man himself, Pac-Man. Best arcade game, just eat those pellets and don't get hit by those ghosts. Great game. Now, the Gotta Catch Em All video game, Pokemon, has multiple games, multiple Pokemon, and the best is gym battles and catching every single one of those Pokemon that are over 700. Now, the grandfather, or godfather, of all video games, the, the game that started it all, Pong. It's easy, just like tennis, but with just white paddles, you move up and down, and just try to bounce the ball into your opponent's side and win very classic. Now, The Sims. I have never played The Sims game before. It's just it's just a computer game, but it looks interesting, but never tried it. But I, I'm sure that's a good choice. Now, Sonic the Hedgehog, number 10. A fast little critter running around in high speed, stopping Dr. Robotnik and saving little woodland creatures. Good game, and he's, the, he's still, he's a classic in, in the Sega Genesis system. Now, Space Invaders. Now, that's an also a classic game. I have tried that before, but it was on Game Boy. And I'm sure that that one will tie between that and Pong. Now, number 13, Super Mario Brothers. The video game that saved the video game franchise. Saved it all. That little plumber with his little brother, Luigi. Well, he's not little brother, but you know what I'm saying. He's taller, but either way, Super Mario Brothers saved the franchise, and I'm sure that will be the one that we win. Now, number 14, Tetris. A great puzzle game. Having blocks coming down, you have to put it in the different sides and shapes, and all you have to do is just put them in the right order, deplete it, and if you get up to the top, you lose. Great game. Now, I played this once, number 15. Now, World of Warcraft. That's a very addicting game. I have two brothers who have tried it, but I'm not much of a computer person. I always play Wii, PlayStation, you name it. Good game, but I have never tried it, but my brothers say it is the best game ever. Now, out of those top 15 choices, I think the game that really deserves to be in the Hall of Fame, Pong. Pong was the very first game that started the whole video game franchise. From there all the way to the Wii U, which is the newer system right now, and then there was PS1, PS1, PS2, and then Xbox, Xbox 360, but no Xbox 2, but that's a good thing. But I'm surprised that Mega Man isn't on, the, on this choice as the Video Game Hall of Fame.